Today we're going to be taking a look at the best suspension enhancements for your 2017 Chevrolet Silverado 3500. We got our three basic types of helper springs here. Here we're going to have the jount style helper spring and in the middle we're going to have our air helper springs and here on the end is going to be our leaf spring helper springs. Now for each style of our helper springs here we do carry a full line of different products now, they may look different, have a different color, or possibly a different brand, but this is just a representation of the style that we carry, and you can find all of these on our website. Now, if we've ever hauled a heavy load in our truck, we've all experienced the sagging the back end does. Not only is it putting extra strain on our rear suspension, but it's also pulling up on the front suspension, which mis aims our headlights, the tires aren't making good at contact, and in the back, it is wearing out our suspension. So that's where our helper springs are gonna come into play. It's gonna help level out our truck when the load is in there to keep it from sagging and prematurely wearing out our suspension. Our jount style helper springs are gonna replace our factory bump stops and they're gonna mount in between our axle and the frame. Now when we're unloaded and we don't have anything in our bed, our ride is not gonna be affected, but while we load them, our springs are gonna become compressed and become stiffer and give us the support we need, preventing the bed and the suspension from sagging down. Now, one of the main benefits of the Jound style is once we have them installed, they are gonna give us the support and prevent our truck from sagging, but at the same time, there's no adjustments and there's no maintenance with these. Now, our air springs do look quite a bit different and there's quite a bit more involved. Now, the way these are gonna mount is using the brackets, they're gonna mount in the same spot as our factory jount stop, but we have the option, since they are air bags and air helper springs, we have the adjustment anywhere from five to 100 PSI, depending on which bags you have, to adjust the load support and level out your truck, as well as provide us a smooth ride when we don't have anything loaded. The leaf spring helper springs are gonna take another approach as well. They're not gonna replace our factory jount stops, but rather be an extra leaf spring attached to our factory leaf springs to give it extra support, but also act as a stabilizing device to prevent the leaf springs from twisting. So not only are they gonna give us our load support, but they are gonna give us a slight height adjustment and also the stabilization from keeping the rear axle from twisting around. Now, all three of our kits do work independently from one side to the other. So whether we're using our air springs, leaf springs, or our helper springs, the jount style, each side is gonna work by itself. So if you have an off-center load, one side is gonna be helping it more than the other, but it's gonna keep the truck nice and level. Now, as far as installation, typically the jount style helper springs are gonna be the easiest to install out of our three types because they simply are just a replacement jount stop that bolts into place. Now our leaf spring helper springs are a little bit more involved, but they're not that bad. We're gonna have a couple attachment points on each end, as well as some hardware that's gonna mount this spring on top of our existing factory leaf spring. Now our air springs are gonna be the most in-depth for the installation, but since they are the most in-depth, we do get a benefit out of it because they are the most adjustable. There is plenty of brackets and quite a bit of hardware, as well as running the airlines to our brackets that we're gonna to need to do. But like I said, we're gonna have the most adjustment and a most low leveling support that we're gonna get out of any of our kits. Our jound style helper springs are gonna be great if you have a constant load or the load is not ever changing in your truck because there is no adjustability, but it is still gonna provide us that support to keep our truck level and not wear out our suspension. Now, one thing I do wanna mention is with our jount style springs, they are designed to work with a working and properly maintained suspension system. Our leaf spring style helper springs are gonna give us the best of both worlds here. They are gonna give us the support that we need when we have a heavy load, but at the same time, we're also gonna have height adjustability when we make our adjustments. Now, that's gonna come into play if you tow a lot of different things or you haul a lot of different size loads and you don't know exactly what you're gonna be carrying. Well, this is gonna give you the adjustability to go from a heavy, heavy load to a softer load and not compromise the comfort of your ride. One of the nice benefits of our leaf spring style is that if you do have an older vehicle where the leaf springs are starting to sag naturally without any load in there, if we have these set on a low setting of support and height, 
they will bring it back to that factory ride height, giving you a little bit more better of a stance. Our air springs are gonna give us the most adjustability, whether we're carrying an extremely heavy load all the way to an extremely light load or nothing at all. They're still gonna give us a comfortable ride while leveling the truck out. And the air springs are gonna benefit people greatly that tow or haul a lot of different loads and they never really know exactly how much they're gonna be towing. That way, with the air adjustability, we're gonna have a couple valves that will be installed, and then we can either just add or remove some air to get the perfect height and load leveling support. So to sum everything up, each one of the styles will help you keep the back end of your truck from sagging and premature wear on your suspension. But as far as maintenance goes, I think the jount style helper springs are gonna take it here because once they're installed, there is no adjustments and there is no maintenance to worry about. Now, as far as adjustability does go, I think our air helper springs are gonna take it here because we do have a wide range of adjustability, not only from side to side, but also in general with height and the load support that they're gonna give us. Now, as far as ease of installation goes, again, I think our jount style springs are gonna be the easiest to install purely because they simply replace our factory jount stops and there's only a few things that we have to bolt in place. And then I'll finish up a look at the best suspension enhancements for your Chevrolet Silverado 3500. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.